Well, some of the largest fast food chains have received a failing grade from consumer and environmental groups. Betty Yu joins us now with how many of them are serving beef that was raised with antibiotics. Ken and Veronica, 25 of the largest burger chains in the United States were graded, and most of them got an F in the report. It looked at practices and policies on the use of antibiotics in their beef products. The report gave these 22 chains an F grade. They include McDonald's, Burger King, Jack in the Box, Five Guys, and in and out The report looked at whether these companies are making policies to end the use of antibiotics. It gave only two chains an A grade for serving antibiotic-free beef, that's Shake Shack and Burger Five. In and out got a failing grade because it made no timeline-backed pledge to move away from antibiotics in their burgers. Two years ago, in and out announced that it intends to source beef raised without medically important antibiotics, but researchers said the chain has yet to follow through with a real commitment. Well, I have to say I'm really surprised. Like, I really wasn't expecting that. I was, I don't know, I was thinking, like, they would have, like, better... Grace with all like their policies and everything. I'm still going to eat it in and out, surprisingly <laughs> enough. It's like a staple here. My mom is actually visiting from Texas and she's like, I want in and out. I don't like McDonald's and Burger King, so this is the only burger I like. But now knowing this, I don't know where to eat burgers anymore. <laughs> The collaborative report was done by groups including the Center for Food Safety and Consumer Reports. It says many meat producers give animals antibiotics to encourage quicker growth or to stave off disease, calling it a routine practice. Public health experts are concerned about the overuse of antibiotics. The problem of antibiotic resistance, which comes from overuse of antibiotics, both in humans and animals, is a crisis at this point. The National Cattlemen's Beef Association says the beef industry promotes the judicious use of antibiotics to keep potential risk of developing antibiotic-resistant bacteria extremely low. McDonald's says it's now working to roll out an antibiotics policy for beef by the end of the year. And according to Consumer Reports, about 60% of people would pay more for a burger that was raised hmm. without absolutely. the That's use absolutely of antibiotics. Right. Sure. Interesting. All right. Thank yeah. you, Betty. Thanks, Betty.